So OnePlus is all set to launch their 10th gen high-end flagship device with their gen 1 CPU and the main focus this time is perfection. Here they want to improve the design, software, image processing and overall specifications. This is your live look at OnePlus 10 Pro in both green and black color options. Here this device looks quite different from the regular devices we have in market and the main idea behind this is OnePlus want people to recognize yes this is a OnePlus device. The OnePlus 8T and 9 series had this generic finish which looks same like Samsung Galaxy A series, Realme, Oppo and Vivo devices so it was sort of same devices for a common man in terms of design. Some more official images of OnePlus 10 Pro, yeah this design may look hideous but it's different and new and I like that part. So now main focus once again is on cameras, here are some images shot using the 10 Pro and OnePlus have done an amazing job. They say this device can now shoot 10 bit colors by default, OnePlus is calling it their 1 billion solution. This phone can take 12 bit color images that is 68 billion colors, here never settle right? OnePlus says the colors are more sharp and accurate with the Hasselblad 2.2. Now the exciting part is wide angle shooter can take max out 150 degrees wide angle shots and that is something insane. There is swish eye mode and cinematic pro movie mode too. Sad part is they are using same telephoto lens which is quite shocking cause Xiaomi, Samsung all are moving to periscope and OnePlus is stuck with the same 3.3x telephoto zoom. Some more changes in terms of software and hardware, this device is coming with hyper boost, full length, game frame stabilization and that tech took 2 years for OnePlus for completion. This is gonna maintain the frame rate and temperature as well, the Gen 1 SoC heats a lot and for that OnePlus is using VC cooling plate, copper graphite sheet and heat dissipation silica gel. Some official specs coming in, so a gen 1 silicon adreno 730 gpu, 5000 mAh battery, 80 watts of fast charging, 50 watts wireless, second gen LTPO tech, second gen Hasselblad collaboration and of course IP68 rating. The launch kicks in on 11th gen for China and soon for India, US and Europe. Here of course unboxing and hands on coming really soon, this all guys thanks so much for watching, like subscribe and I'll meet you guys in the next one. Peace out.